Hi, and welcome to Unit 9 of U.S. History, titled Industry and Immigration. This is a period that takes place between 1865 and 1914. <clears throat> Excuse me. So, in this video, we're going to examine the transformative impact of late 19th century technological innovations on U.S. industry. We're going to look at the profound influence of mass immigration on socioeconomic dynamics in American cities. Uh, we will be analyzing primary sources to discern factors shaping diverse immigration patterns. Um, we're going to investigate the emergence of social classes and urbanization during the Industrial Revolution. And finally, synthesize insights into the interconnectedness of industrialization, emigration, and the evolving American identity in those years. So, we'll begin with an in-depth examination of the late 19th century technological innovations that reshaped the landscape of U.S. industry. The advent of inventions such as the telegraph, telephone, and the assembly, assembly line ushered in a new era of productivity, transforming the economic fabric of the nation. As we navigate this technological revolution, we'll unravel its implications for industrial growth, job creation, and the overall trajectory of the American economy. Shifting our focus next, we'll turn our attention to the impact of mass immigration on the socio uh, economic dynamics in American cities. The influx of immigrants during this period brought forth a mosaic of cultures, labor forces, and social challenges. We will assess how this demographic shift influenced urban development, labor markets, and the formation of eth ethnic enclaves, providing a nuanced understanding of the intricate tapestry of American society during this time. Next, and in the pursuit of historical accu accuracy, um, we will delve into an analysis of primary sources to understand the multifaceted factors influencing um, diverse immigration patterns. So by scrutinizing letters, diaries, and official documents from the era, we aim to understand the motivations challenges, and aspirations of immigrants, of immigrants going to the U.S., shedding some light on the complexities that shaped the demographic landscape of the United States. Okay, so venturing further into the social and economic landscape, we will examine the emergence of social classes and urbanization during the throes of industrialization. Now, as you remember, urbanization is the movement from rural areas into cities that are due to pull factors such as jobs. The rapid growth of industries drew masses to urban centers, giving rise to complex social structures and challenging notions of class and privilege. So by understanding that and by analyzing the urban development, living conditions and class dynamics, we're going to unravel some of the societal transformation that accompanied industrial expansion and that actually played a big role in how things are today. So on our final day of the week, we're going to talk about the uh, interconnected roles of industrialization, immigration, and American identity. So what we do is basically synthesize the insights garnered from our exploration, aiming to unravel the interconnectedness. And as we navigate through this web of economic, demographic, and cultural changes, we're going to uncover how these forces shape the nation's identity and set the stage for the complex interplay of historical forces that define the United States in the present day. So to wrap this up rather briefly, uh, we're going to reflect on the transformations, profound transformations, 
that marked the late 19th century in the United States. We're going to take a look at the confluence of technological innovation, mass immigration, and societal changes that laid the groundwork for the nation we know today. And through rigorous analysis and synthesis, we have um, endeavored to provide a nuanced understanding of this critical period in U.S. history. So I hope that you found this to be informative so far. Don't be um, uh, repelled by the language used in the objectives. So we've analyzed primary sources before. Um, basically, we might have a little project that we might start off early in term two, where we take a look at some of these primary sources and try to think of, um, of ways uh, on how immigrants to the United States would be like today. So, for example, uh, we can look at the time of late 19th century, a diary of an immigrant, and see their aspirations, their fears, uh, what they think of America, so on and so forth. And we can compare it to someone today, someone who's seeking to go to the U.S. as an immigrant and who would write a diary laying down the factors and um, motives that would drive him to go there or her. We're also going to talk about uh, social classes. We're going to relate this to some current events. Uh, there's continuous talk of a shrinking middle class, as you might know, throughout the world, especially in capitalistic countries such as the U.S. So we're going to take a closer look at social classes and how they're defined and what their characteristics are. So thank you, and I look forward to working with you all in the coming week. Thank you.